Good morning everyone, welcome back to Natalia's channel Lovecraft Forever and you can see I have a here big bag it has in here diamond painting, we have some cross stitching uh, we do have an unboxing today from fan cells now I did uh, told you before that I received a couple more packages with the packing of diamond painting that look like oh, they look like this double packing and you can feel there is a roller so <laughs> I was terrified to receive this from Fancel and yes I did receive so let me show you what we have in here but don't run away I have some explanation to do for you so let me pull out uh, I thought okay maybe you, you know like one or two packing like this that would be fine um, okay so this one is normal but when I received this many almost all my order came in this pack in one two three four five and one more little one um, this should be like for uncle so I got a little scared to be honest a little bit disappointed and we have some cross stitching in here okay that now is empty so what happened and I do have one more company that I need to do unboxing video yet uh, and they have exactly same packing uh, after my first video review uh, many of you were disappointed and say that you're not going to shop anymore in those stores if they go backwards not forward you know it used to be a double-sided adhesive canvases that we had lots of problem and only one positive comment I received from my friend that she actually like a double-sided adhesive but nobody else um, and to be honest I'm not a fan of that either because you always kind of constantly need to fight, fight with uh, rivers and bubbles so I did wrote a big long email to fan cell and I did not write down email to other companies because I kind of <clears throat> have a friendship with fans the longest of all and they are all go with the same uh, head office same warehouse so I knew if I will write down to fan cell they will pass to the office uh, higher to tell and um, you know my theory and why this is not good idea to bring this kind of canvases to the store so last night i uh, received a reply from a fan sales owner of the website and he totally understand where i'm coming from and they explained that um, the um, company was trying to do some different uh, uh, product uh, see how this is gonna go and and they decided so yes this is, wasn't a good idea and they will not bring this canvases anymore like this so if you still will receive it's probably because it's already was in a store I don't know but they promised me they will be sticking with poor Aunt glue and they will not experiment anymore with this packaging uh, of um, because this is going to be a hundred percent sure that this is double-sided adhesive but you know what let's open and see what we have uh, so this one there is uh, I mean this will be for sure of uh, pour on glue uh, I will open them some other time so we have in here um, I have in here two cross stitches I will open them in separate video we will not mix it uh, and yesterday we did have some mixing video of cross stitching and uh, diamond painting and other 3D project plus yesterday uh, Catherine did some whip and chat with you if you did not see that video please uh, stop by and look and give her some good encouragement she tried so today we will open let's see what we will open we will not open this one today one two three or let's open 
four canvases today and this three we will open some other time and then we will, will open a third video cross stitch and I think that will be all right so I will put this back into the bag Uh, lots of you like that canvas that is, um, you know, the, like a little squares, different colors of squares, like a mosaic type. So I'm thinking, what if I pull out that glue and uh, replace, as I did tutorial with you one time, how to make a canvas sticky again? Maybe I should redo them so let's see what's in here I can't believe all my orders almost all of them came with this kind of adhesive and it's all over okay good thing we have to open because the glue everywhere oh my god and this is <laughs> oh my goodness you gotta love this canvas okay I don't care at this point that this is double-sided adhesive. I love this canvas as, um, you know, as a picture. So the good thing about this, okay, they have amazing tools. I have to say, I, and that's what was uh, we were uh, unboxing with you the other canvases as well. So in here it is amazing tools. If this would be like this with the pour and glue it's excellent it would be excellent so there's a here plus we have a here plus the only minus it's a glue so let's scratch that right now and let's see this awesome awesome kit they have with this canvases so we have in here four placer which is very popular already now before we never have them now they do have a, and already this grippy the glittery pen one placer and we have big chunk of wax and we have a 10 placer so that is amazing and look at this um, this one this is just a cheap tweezers tweezers not good in here you can scrap them but other than that this is amazing kit of tools I have to say it this is great now another good future in here and this is uh, square diamonds. I think most of them. Um, and you know what? I'm going to tell you something that maybe if you're afraid to receive at this point this kind of canvases, you can avoid square diamonds because most of the product that came new product into the store is a square diamonds. And I believe all this will be in square diamonds. And that's why they are like this so if you are afraid to get this canvas order around diamonds so we have in here look at this it's like it's amazing because I love it it's already prepacked into the ziplock bags so that that is a good service right there I love this future we will count a little bit but now let me show you why I love this canvas so much because it's it's me it's me in here my outer portrait you don't believe me let me show you oh you will die the I will just no I can't put this on the floor because for in case my puppy run and start to chew on it okay we find an adhesive Okay, are you ready? This is me. This is me. Look at that. Big eyes with cup of coffee. And I say, oh, it's maybe like two or three o'clock in the morning. So I have to start crafting. Who sleeps? Nobody sleeps. Ooh. <laughs> so, yes. Oh my God. When I saw this image, it screams me, you know, that it's me because I love to stay late at night okay the best way not to create lots of rivers is while you opening this glue 
don't flatten your canvas first flatten glue by removing this sheet first so the glue relax better instead of forcing with the paper because the way they roll on a roller so obviously glue can be a little bit stretched as a normal thing but let me show you how amazing this owl okay so far canvas looks very good okay you know what give me a second I have to put away these canvases in here because I need a more room on the table excuse me for a sec okay I really need a very very careful stretch to replace it okay and then we have in here of course this is the good future and I'm just so glad that they actually using this foam roller because without this foam roller the packing would be squished and canvas would be have lots and lots of problems so this way it's actually really good that they use in the rollers okay we're gonna open a little bit more maybe now I can flatten in here gentle we will do slowly okay I hope you're not in a rush nowhere I just need to release this pressure on this side just a right in here and that's it I can restick this one back you see how automatically it's straight in here when you peel and be careful so you don't grab at the same time with the paper your glue unless you want to redo glue that it's okay to grab it together with it okay there okay now our canvas is completely flat and I have to say that right now as I'm looking I do not see any air bubbles yet few kind of wrinkles from glue being stretched but doesn't have a air bubbles under and I can show you very close to camera let me get off of my chair so you can see with your own eyes uh, so you can even see uh, there's there's no can you see it a tiny tiny no you, you can't even see it so the canvas quality is really good actually no air bubbles and I will be keeping them in my craft room stretched like this on my table but look at this queen she has a uh, she has like she just so funny um, just just look at this owl for a second look at her open mouth she's like cuckoo one eye is open one eye is halfway open she's drinking coffee fighting with the sleep I, when I saw this image I'm just like 100% it's me I see myself in it two three o'clock in the morning I was like still cry last night I was diamond painting till three o'clock in the morning oh yeah because I wanted to finish section uh, that I planned and I did finish so I feel really satisfied and I went to sleep like a champion all right the canvas is great condition besides the glue it still didn't have any damage because thanks to this roller and now we have in here lots of colors to be honest between uh, double-sided adhesive and pour on glue this kind of canvases always have much more colors in diamond painting for example this one have a 34 colors usually when we unbox with you different canvases like pour on glue they have like a 20 24 colors so this one is definitely will be a better quality uh, by the finishing project uh, because more 
colors more details uh, the only thing I did not uh, try yet to diamond paint them to see quality of the square diamonds if it has a pop in diamonds or not so since I opened this one first and that's the one that I really really waited and I really really love it and I think this one canvas will be like right next to my computer to remind me of myself how I stay late and I always call myself a uh, owl person so I will be starting on this one canvas immediately thank goodness I don't have to organize diamonds it's already on a bag pre-packed so I can start anytime and I'm telling you I will start probably tonight so I want to see if we're gonna have a good coverage I want to see if we're gonna have a pop in diamonds but for now let's count if we have a 34 colors so I just feel like a random like this one two three four five okay this is the black diamond so let me see quality of them uh no it's not black diamonds it's a brown diamonds uh we don't have a trick 10 in here all right not bad one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen 14, 15, look at it just a little bit, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, where's the diamonds escape, 4, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 34. Okay, we have all numbers in here and let me just show you like a random pack of quality of the diamonds. I think they look awesome. I don't see any extension on the sides. I don't think I do. No, looks good. How about this dark, dark brown that I thought would be black? I believe they are good quality. Look at this bright one. So beautiful diamonds. Here is as close as we can see them. Okay, so I'm really happy actually. Um, we will see. Maybe we will be, you know, surprised. But as I say, um, this is like a little bit like a one minus, but the way they pack and organize these canvases, I don't know where they got them from. Uh, I have to say they did a good job unpacking and a Ziploc bags. I always like when they do this. Um, I like the kits in here. So for beginners, this is amazing kit with lots of tools in here. And it's actually a very good tray, not that green cheap tray i love this white tray that's the only tray that i work with so you should be happy about this okay so let me where are we gonna put this away to the side somewhere i might will just leave it like this on the sides i don't know no it's oh one more diamonds from somewhere escape i just will put inside of the bag we'll find a match later I have to move stuff around. Please forgive me for some noises. All right. So canvas number two feels heavy. Yeah, that's an interesting packing. Like they didn't do longer packaging, but like a double, double packing. What's in here? What's in here? Oh, it's cool sticky. Okay, I will right away open this one. 
because it got a sticky residue on it and I cannot stand fat in the glue and it's sticking to your fingers. All right. See, yeah, this one's the same thing. Oh, like, I love, ooh, we have a surprise. Did I miss something in the, hold on. Did I miss something? Let me check this envelopes. No, this one is empty. And when is the other one that I just put away? Just a minute, just a minute. Because we have a surprise. Maybe left in the packaging. No, it's not. Oh, you will like this. Hold on. So this is the package that I just opened. Okay, and this one was the tool was. Look at this. Oh. They put this amazing tweezers that I absolutely love. This is my favorite tweezers. Look at this, it's the sharp, sharp edges. You can work precisely. You can pick some stuff off the canvas if you have to. You can place diamonds with it. Whoa, this is good. This is good. And we have a same toolkit as the other one all the good stuff four placer ten placer one placer so we have a three placers in here with the awesome grippy as well good tray and i just will put in here this is the best tweezers oh bag broken that's why it came out probably from the bag because it has a hole in here okay tweezers poke a hole and again we have in here all diamonds already in a ziplock bag and I see a huge bag of black diamonds so what kind of picture is it let's see <clears throat> there's always struggle to find a beginning of the <laughs> of the Just a minute. Ooh. Okay, now I can see a little bit peekaboo of the image. Um, it's a very pretty one. You know, it's all about sparkles and diamonds. And here we go. If we can look this way. Look at those butterflies, gems, and everything. Um, this is just uh, so pretty to me that um, I don't know. I like sparkles, I like gems, I like glitter, and this to me looks very pretty glittery. So, yes, uh, this is the best way to flatten your canvas. Don't force to open the whole thing because you will create lots of uh, air bubbles. Uh, start from beginning and open as you unroll your canvas. That, that's my the best tip for this kind of canvas, to be honest. Okay. And now we're going to pull together like we did our first one. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Uh, you know what? I never told you the size of my first canvas uh, of the owl. And I'm going to tell you right now, it's a 40 by 40 centimeters. And uh, you know what else I would love to see? Let me grab a measuring tape and I will talk to you as I walk. And I will measure because very often this kind of canvases it could be precise uh, sizing as they state and not the full canvas so for example this one canvas is 40 by 50 so I will measure there's my centimeters I will measure just the printed area so this is 30 and Nine, ten, forty. So 
a little bit not enough to 40 it's almost like 9 39 so yeah not, not exactly 40 but still much bigger than would be in pour on glue would be like a five centimeters from one side not enough and here is only one so it is a uh, approximate like a um, drilling area <clears throat> bigger okay <clears throat> So the owl is 40 by 40 and this one is 40 by 50. Now how much more we need to unroll so we don't stick to the table. I think now I have to pull a little bit from this side so I can open. Okay, now it's flat. I can flip these pages in here back. And unroll. Also roller. I have to say the condition of these canvases are really good. And the way I open them very careful, I do not see not even one air bubble seriously i'm not lying to you <clears throat> so i think this uh, this image i can't figure out yet till i open the whole thing if this is hands pointing up or sideways because the way it's showing me on the picture in here it's a sideway on a website it was like up I think pointing up to the air so now it's flat I can open and we will see you probably already pick up first to me okay sorry not sure how long it was after focus because of the white okay so it looks like a sideway picture Okay. So yeah, the picture is sideways, but I believe on a website, unless I don't remember correctly, I think the hands was like pointing up. So this is to the top, like you let go butterfly up to the air or sideways. I don't know. Um, I think you can you can frame it either way. And there's like a heart shape of hearts in here, beautiful crystal butterflies. And you know what? You can even add in here A, B colors on those white spots when you see kind of like a, um, it should be like a sparkles diamond. So maybe I will add some sparkles in here as I have lots of A, B or even A, B in a square shape that I have leftovers from my other canvases. So this is great. And in here we have a 33 colors. And also we have in here, you know, a DMC code. Even each number, how many diamonds you need to place. So you can calculate and you will know how many diamonds you have to place through the whole canvas. And don't let the number scare you. <laughs> Uh, let me measure one more time this way. I think the way it's measured, the way the, where is glue finishing. So let me measure one more time in uh, centimeters. I will start from the beginning of adhesive. So we have a 30 in here. 40. 40 and 50. What's well, actually it's almost 50 the printed area so yeah just a tiny tiny bit maybe like three millimeters on each side where your printed area so this canvas is definitely bigger than pour on glue so that's another plus we discover with you and in here we have 33 colors so let's quickly look them and i'm interested in here to see square diamonds Ooh, la, la. 
that's a lot of black. I hope they are good diamonds. Because when diamonds not good, it's so annoying to place them. And you know what I will I will pour diamonds right now on a tray so you can see for yourself very very close. We will ex experiment not experiment, we will explore and see what kind of quality of these diamonds. Uh, definitely smaller tray that I have the way I use. Is this is the same size? Feels like first tray a little bit bigger. Okay, let me just, I just put a little bit diamonds because tray small. Still better than green one. And let's see diamonds. Okay, let's check it out, diamonds. I want to see... Is this... If it has a little bit of sight in between the one that I just opened or not. No, I think diamonds are not bad in here. What are you saying? I think they are good diamonds. I don't see any holes on the top of that. So we will be working at some point in them. Okay, that's great. That's great. Diamonds looks good because if 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 some problems would be with diamonds, that would be with the black diamonds for sure. And we don't have a problem with diamonds. Diamonds looks excellent. So now let's check. Okay. Sometimes the way they close Ziploc bags could be closed before diamonds. Oh, this one was even open. Good thing I didn't spill the whole bag. Okay. I think we are good now to count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 30, 33. Excellent. Excellent. This bag is scaring me. That's a lot of diamonds. Oh, one more. One more escape, I think it's from this one back. Looks like the same color. You know, this is awesome. They have a bags already like this. If you are a beginner, you don't have lots of containers. This is really, really big help. And you can start your diamond painting anytime. So what is this brown? Still kind of... No. Looks like which one is the color? Something darker. Oh, the, the first first bag was open. A few more diamonds escape. Okay. So what do you think so far, my dear friends? <clears throat> I think it's good. And now let me see, if, so I don't mix it, if they have a number of the canvas in here. ZQF031. Okay, so I can uh, definitely place them on the top of each other, put diamonds away separately, and I know that I will not mix them. <coughs> I just need to wrap them a little bit more tight. Diamonds. There, and I can just place them right now on the top of each other because we do have a numbers on each canvas and each uh, bag of diamonds that's fine okay number three uh, should we continue with number four we already kind of in what 30 minutes already if you agree to open more or four will be too many today I don't know <clears throat> okay, let's see if this canvas have a good 
type of tweezers. Yeah, the way they glue those edges in here, there's always glue ball on this roller. Oh, that's a beautiful flowers in here. Oh yeah, that's a good one too. Okay, empty now. Wow, so this uh, only one from now we have the uh, bad one, this one. Oh, whoa! <laughs> now I'm even more surprised. Whoa, guys. Wow, I even say word guys that I usually didn't say anymore. Look at this kit. Look at this tray. Maybe you will uh, switch your love to this kind of canvases. I don't know. Look at the size of the tray. Look at this tray. To compare with this little tiny one look at that and we have in here also four placer one placer awesome grippy that it's actually stays pretty much tight doesn't move very easily we have in here I believe it's a ten placer also good good metal stainless steel tweezers Lots of wax and the tray, uh, and this is kind of size. And I have a shape like this uh, in a bigger, bigger tray like this. But this kind of size and shape I don't have yet. So that's good. You can create lots of lines in here, long lines of the diamonds to place. You know, with your multiplacer. Oh, okay. This is amazing. I really, really love this kit, to be honest. This is the first time I see diamond painting kit that would come with this kind of good big, big tray and all these amazing tools and the diamond painting kit, not very expensive. Um, go ahead to the website and check for, especially for the sizes of this uh, canvases and already pre-packed. So yeah, you already figure out, right? So two of our first diamond paintings, we have a square diamonds. So this one also square diamonds. And that's why all the new product that came with this canvases in a square diamonds. So if you don't like it, you have to avoid it. But other than that, I think this is really kind of surprisingly good to me. I don't know. I'm getting warming up uh, still I don't know just if you open your canvas carefully then it should be good okay so let's try to open this one first okay there's a more of the tape to find it this is from under Okay, so this one more, I would say, is this a uh, lilies kind of represent Easter flowers in here, right? So as you can tell, lots of background. Uh, but if you remember me saying before that I really love objects in a black background because that way, look how these flowers will pop up and look so bright and cheery on a dark background. So I decided, okay, I will fight with black diamonds, but I want to try it to work on this one. So hopefully this canvas is in excellent condition also. Okay, this one, a little bit coming out together with the glue, have to be careful. Okay, just the edges kind of grabbing it, so I have to very, very slow to start. And then you save after that. Okay, now we are safe. 
and we can unroll it together just grab it to pieces and your canvas will be oh wow look at how beautiful look how beautiful yeah lots of black diamonds that's for sure and it says in here size uh, big um, it's almost like what more than centimeters let me check centimeter and a half excess of glue like in here on the top centimeter and a half so you definitely need a washi tape to cover while you diamond painting so you don't have a <clears throat> so you don't have nothing stick to this glue because your hands will be stick to it your clothes okay now I'm carefully gonna flatten this side and unroll lots of uh, rolls I have we should do some kind of tutorial what to do with all those rolls uh, I did tutorial one time on dreamers design channel what to do with this roll form I created wreath for the Christmas time you can create wreath for the Easter Right. looks to me <clears throat> like this is another awesome canvas that has no bubbles whatsoever wow the, the quality of this canvas is I'm telling you I'm really surprised actually travel in a safe way it just because help of this rose this is definitely uh, do the magic so there, uh, picture is uh, printed in here sideways, but of course it will be this way, right? So I'm not going to turn right now because I don't want to uh, disturb my glue. But yeah, that, that's a lots of black diamonds to place in here. And guess what? I think I will go after black color first all the way around canvas or maybe like by the section and then go black the other one like usually if I diamond paint with this kind of uh, glue and it's because it's already cut on half I would start kind of like you know keeping a half close in here start on this corner then I would close this side and open this side and then work up there and turn around canvas to meet the other way work the same way and then go after colors but definitely I like to eliminate black color first so kind of like I'm done the most difficult part but yeah this, this is a very very gorgeous image let's find a focus doesn't want to focus no okay now it's focusing it is beautiful lilies okay so this is what we have in here now how many colors we have here 32 so first canvas was what 34 I think yeah 34 33 32 we're going one down all the time how fun is that now let's see all these beautiful colors in here I see one orange diamond escape in here and one more brown I guess they didn't close it like that tight enough or could we just stick with the person hands who cut this package and diamonds escape then one more purple diamond and that is a color which color no maybe something darker looks like a different color I don't see it 
Oh, this one maybe. Okay. Let's hide this diamond in here. Then we have one kind of like a orange brownie. This will go to this bag. Every diamond matter, just for in case. I don't know, we will see. I'm telling you, I will start an owl as soon as possible so we can tell if we have good quality canvases because we need to explore them. Okay, this one doesn't even match nowhere, so I'm just gonna put in a bag. This one escaped from something else. Okay, the bag of black diamonds. <laughs> Holy moly, look at that. Look at the huge bag of these diamonds. What do we see? I think we see in here a good quality diamonds, that's what I see. So let's count. Okay, my friends, sorry about that. I have to stop video. And so I already count all diamonds in here. And I just want to show you some of the colors. They are very, very beautiful. Let's just pick the most brighter one. Oh, so gorgeous. I will put numbers the other way. Like it's just so stunning. Just want to show you a few of those colors, how beautiful they are. Look at that. So diamonds quality looks like really, really good. All right, so this is canvas number three. I have to say that I'm impressed so far. Lots of pluses in this unboxing. Lots of good surprises that I did not expect. Now let me put this is the biggest one from this one 50 by 40 another one same thing 50 by 40 and my owl is smaller one so this is how I will be keeping them on the top of each other like this till I'm ready to work on of course this owl I will be working probably my first that I would love to work Okay, so let's see, should we open one more? Let's open one more. One more left, let's get started. There. What kind of surprise in here? Here's the canvas, okay, so this one canvas got a little bit bended. Okay, now this one bag is empty. The kit, now kit, this one kit a little bit different, uh, same as the first one. We have a 10 placer, big square, good white tray, four placer, one placer, and the cheap tweezers. And also square, yeah, so that's what I say. Uh, if you order in square diamonds, most likely you will receive this kind of canvas. And I see that this canvas got a little bit cranked. I don't know. And okay. You know what? This canvas that I will show you right now, I think I accidentally just yesterday ordered this one again because I forgot. I have this one. This package looked like travel a little bit longer. Oh, now I will have a two of this, unless I'm mistaken something. Okay, so let's see. Let's see what we have in here. What kind of surprise will I, oh, and this one is, what? Okay, just a minute. Is this a spore on glue? Roll on a roll? Hold on, very soft canvas, very easy applies. Let me get that sticker out. Okay, now I'm a little bit surprised and confused. Let's see if factory fool us and put double-sided glue in here or not. But look at this one. 
It does has a roller, but lower, uh, roller got a little bit like squished, so that's why kind of got indentation into the canvas. But thankfully, I believe this is pour on glue. Yes, it is. Oh, okay. Well, that's a lovely surprise. And is a surprise for you to see this canvas? <laughs> Look at this canvas. Who is this? The golden retriever. Okay, sideway probably better to see it. Oh, I can't believe it. I think I just yesterday ordered one more like this because I forgot I already ordered. And I don't remember if the other one will be. Because this one is a square diamonds. Same concept of the canvas like all that we opened today, but this one has a pour on glue. So why they don't do it all the way like this? Glue feel very sticky. So let's replace it to make it look more. Oh, that's a lovely surprise. Wow. Look at that body and Daisy. Oh, <laughs> this is so heartwarming. Wow, I don't remember that I ordered this one. Did I order this one? Isn't that amazing? Oh my God, Barry and Daisy. Uh, for those who don't know, if you are new on my channel, uh, we do have a body, a golden retriever, four years old, and we just got the baby puppy, a girl, and her name is Daisy, and she's nine weeks old now. Oh my goodness, this is so precious. Let me show you the thumbnail. That will be better. You can see better picture. Okay, let's find it there. Look how gorgeous. Uh, I can place on a wall this way. So it's kind of like uh, when the a little puppy dreaming to become a gorgeous, big and luscious dog. Or you can put on a wall this way. So it's like big poppy thinking about his memory of being a child. This is so gorgeous to me. Oh my God. And I believe they have a different, I know they have a tigers like this. They have a cats like this from kitten to the bigger cat. Um, I'm not sure if dif different kind of dogs picture like this. So I think it's, it's so beautiful to me because it's represent my furry family. Oh, this is so nice. This is so nice. So I guess now I will have a two pictures of this because just yesterday we were looking on a website and Catherine says, oh yes, yes, I want this one. Unless, hmm, cannot remember. Um, so anyway, I will enjoy right now with this one because to me it's so gorgeous, but then again, uh, look at this background. If you think this is black diamonds, uh, you will be mistaken for it. Well, half of it because uh, let me show you this background in here. Okay, the reflection of my chandelier, of course, not going to make me. Okay, it's uh, kind of like a confetti area. So obviously, probably black in a mix with brown colors. But canvas is super clean and gorgeous. Oh, I'm so glad I opened this canvas today. Oh, Catherine going to be so happy to see this. And how many colors we have in here? Let's see, 35 colors. Oh, you know, this is so funny. Uh, so we have in here four diamond paintings. And we have, so this one, 35 colors, 34, 33, and 32. So one <laughs> going up or one going down color. So here is 35 colors. Let's open and count them. There's a huge bag of diamonds. Oh, you know what? I'm looking in here on uh, DMC Code Legend. It's a uh, no black color in here at all. So this is dark blue, I think. 
what this big bag in here let's put this way first what is it look at this there's two big bags so okay we don't have a black background at all this is uh, navy dark navy blue and brown color so that's our background two huge bags so two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six twenty seven twenty eight twenty nine 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. And I see one diamond in here came out probably from the brown bag. None of the bag is missing. Everything is perfect. This canvas is perfect too. Same, absolutely same concept. Very nice, soft and applicable canvas. I love the amount of colors in here. 35 colors for like barely any color in the picture if you think about it. So I just wish the old canvases was like this. And this one size uh, 50 by 40. So if we measure just the printed area. So it's a 39. 39. So short just a five millimeters on both sides or would be five millimeters on each side of the canvas so that's a much better I love it wow this is amazing thank you so much fan self for this package most of this uh, I do find lots of pluses from this unboxing uh, the only um, Minus would be on a double-sided glue, but the way they were um, The way they were planned uh, with the roller I cannot complain at all because the quality is Super good for this kind of canvases. So here we go. We have tons of good stuff more tray tray kits is amazing and then of course with the help of these rolls we save our canvases well they save our canvases the way who's gonna order and if you want to stay away from this kind of stuff just order around diamond painters and i believe you will not get um double-sided glue but for those who like it who like the challenge sure you can do it you can see the old canvases was really really good quality today and a good condition so uh, no complaints in here and they did promise not to bring double-sided glue in the future uh, yeah that, that that's great i think i'm really really happy with today unboxing thank you so much everyone for staying with me i wish you all good day stay healthy stay safe um love each other tell everybody that you love them uh your family members give a call if they are across the ocean and I will see you tomorrow with something new.